YouTube, what's going on, y'all boys? Bringing y'all a special gameplay. Special gameplay. I know y'all see the QB, Johnny Unitas, Johnny U, Johnny Football. I know it's not Johnny Football, but y'all get the point. Going up against someone that is honestly very annoying. And this game shows why this game does not have a skill gap whatsoever. So I saw win slot week. I'm like, oh man, this dude gonna RPO glitch me. But he actually ran a play action. I'm so surprised. And this is basically what he did the whole game. Check down, check down, check down, check down, check down, check down. Like I have never seen someone throw so many check downs as I felt like I got cheated a little bit there. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. He got acro pick artist and he's six seven. But, you know, it is what it is. That's kind of what happens with this game. He calls the same plays over and over, takes off with Henry. Good game by him. But this game is special for another reason. I'm going to say it at the end of the video if y'all don't catch on. Or if you're at the beginning of the video and you have an idea of what you think it is, drop it in the comment section. Let me know what you think. I'm going to reveal the answer at the end of it all. So it's a second and goal. He taken off, and of course, uh, I, I, someone was there. I know he was manned up, but he, w someone was there. Someone was there. As you can see, the nasty. Look at that spin move, bro. We were off to the race. I don't know how Taylor Mays grabbed that man. I don't even think he had full maze. If he did, my fault. I'm tripping. I'm bugging out. But I don't think he should have gotten caught there. But it is what it is. You know, we rocking Johnny U. This was the same day he came out, so I'm just chilling in Weekend League, just trying to get some games in. Nice little pickup by Cliff Branch, first down, he left the flat open, I'm going to take it. We in that Bengals playbook, running tight slots, and some other stuff that you're going to see in the video. But, and then he ran commit. <laughs> this is another funny thing. So, this was the day that the run commit glitch got patched. That's how you know this guy is a bot. <laughs> he he didn't even know about the run commit glitch being patched. And I thought that was completely hilarious. So I take my free tutty to the crib. I'm not complaining about that. Picks up the first down with Ricky Williams. And you kind of see something developing. If he's not going to run the ball, hand off to Ricky or take off with Henry, he's just going to throw to the flats. As he throws to the flats, he gets cheated. Thank you, EA. He did something right for the first time. Uh, you don't really do that too often. Takes off with Henry. Pressure doesn't come home. And that's all this guy knew how to do. And now he's in single back wing pair or wing tight, whatever that is. Trying to get me with tight end attack. Like, yeah, okay, okay. And now terrible user by me. I was kind of in position. I decided to take myself out of position and he scores. But you could kind of get the idea that all I need is one mistake and dude's going to quit. Nice little spin move. That's that new Jared Cook. He got 95 speed. Playoff Jared Cook. Snagged him for 100k. Definitely a pretty good card. But I think I like Finley more. Now you nice with that escape artist. This was before. Before. The patch. Well not the patch. But the AP update change. So I was rocking all three on United. Just feeling him out. Pause. So he got escape slinger and hot route master. And he was he was not bad. The only problem with Unitas was his garbage ass release. And if I'm gonna play with a garbage ass release, I'll just play with Payne Manning. Worst release in the game. But for some reason I liked it more than his shitty ass release. Like that thing was terrible. Like it looks exactly like generic three. But for some reason it kinda has like a delay. I'm not sure exactly how to explain it. Like you have to play with Gen 1. So you can see and then go to Gen 3 and then you'll see exactly what I mean. And when you see that, then you'll understand where I'm coming from. Like put Pacity Elite on Gen 3. It, that's exactly how Gen 1 feels like. It does not feel like he has Gunslinger. And look at Walter Payton showing that he got some big ass balls. And now here I just go to a formation I never even used before. Doubles Y off. Devin Hester. Out route. Touchdown. I felt like it was going to work. It, it popped up in my head, so I decided to call it. And, you know, pretty decent play call by me. So that basically ended the half. Now going into the second half. 
Look how slow that release is, but look at Devin Hester. If he does not have deep out elite, that is not a catch. That will never be a catch. And then we quick little spin move into the end zone, and just like that, we right back on top. And safe to say, Johnny Yu, he ain't missing throws. It's just his release is... Ah, it's it's not good. It's not good. It's it's cheeks. It's cheeks. It's bad. It's bad. It's like it's like a loose grandmother's ass. Like it's not good. But he kind of cooking right now, low key. I ain't gonna hold that to him. As you can see, he all he's doing is hiking stock plays. Like if it's look at and look at this. Look at this. Like this motherfucker giving me the coach suggestion tour. If this game has some type of skill gap, I promise you. <laughs> Would have been a blowout. Really would have been a blowout. But the good thing, not everyone's going to be running around like a headless chicken like this. Because Gunslinger, Skate Artist, 11 AP. The only good thing EA has done all year. But they raised Gunslinger. Stupid. Stupid as fuck. Real fucking stupid. So, he's not going to be doing stuff like that much more often anymore. And I can't complain about that. I'm glad they did that. Skate parts is fun. It's cool, but it's broken. It's absolutely broken. But you needed it at the time because if not, you know, it was, it's just a nice convenience to have. But luckily, they took care of it. And that's his offense. Just run with Henry, run with Henry, hand off to Ricky, throw check down, check down, check down. And that's all. That's That's his offense. So definitely it was a very frustrating game to say the least as I get a terrible bounce terrible bounce there and you know I call it I go right back to the same play you know it's a, it's a great play probably the best play in tight Y off scramble out I'm throwing that no matter what Devin Hester too damn fast for Dion Dion with his shitty ass press he's never gonna catch up to that never so we looking real good on offense. He really has no answer for us. And that's why, you know, I'm not worried. Like, I'm literally not worried whatsoever. It's just one of those players that are very annoying. Very, very annoying. And if it wasn't for a skate artist, he would have quit out like 30 years ago. But luckily, we don't have to worry about that anymore because it is patched. And I take off right there. I thought I got in for the touchdown. But I was a yard short. But I honestly don't mind that because I get to take a couple seconds off the clock. I find Bo Jackson for the tutty. And now we up seven. So all we got to do is just seal this game real quick and we'll be good. As you can see, he playing scared. He handed the ball out to Ricky Williams. We ain't worried about that. You're going to have to no huddle. And we are perfectly fine with that. You can see Henry scrambles out. Finds Dupree on the sideline, stops the clock. That's the only thing we don't want. But as long as he throws it in the middle of the field, we are chilling. So now here, throws a slant. And look at Sean Taylor cleaning his fucking clock. Absolutely drilled him, pulverized him, penetrated him. Made sure he felt everything from his body on him. That is Sean Taylor. Total domination. And just like that, he knows it is GG's and that is GG's. He concedes the game. If you guys like what you are seeing, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube. Follow me on Twitch, Sweaty Santana. We on Twitter too, Sweaty Santana. And keep showing the love. I appreciate y'all. Y'all be easy.